Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at a Henry Homesteader. Auto loading, nine millimeter carbine made by Henry. They are known for lever action guns. This is the first auto loading rifle that they have in production. It's a very nice carbine with a 16.37 inch barrel, American walnut. The craftsmanship with Henry rifles are amazing and they're shotguns. I have a lever action axe and I'm still impressed with it. Very impressed with this Homesteader. Now this is available in three separate configurations. This one has Glock mags available. I had to switch out the mag adapter with the Glock mags so that it'll fit Glock mags, but it comes with two proprietary Henry mags, a five and a 10 rounder. And that model goes for an MSRP of 928. This goes for $9.59. So it has the Henry mag only, the Glock mag adapter, and another model with an adapter for M&P 9 magazines and SIG P320 mags. So that's how this rifle comes, but it, the American Walnut's absolutely beautiful. Now it's a bit heavy, right under seven pounds. But what it offers is quite a bit, a ton of fun. I'm going to get it over to the table so we can take a look at it. I have a lot of rounds through it already. I just got it, I, I fired it quite a bit. Very happy with the craftsmanship, the accuracy of it, being that it is heavy, you hardly feel any of the pushback, the little bit of pushback that nine millimeter offers, but a nice all around package. Let's take a closer look. We'll start with the stock. Very nice American walnut stock with a rubber recoil pad. Goes a little over a half inch, has a bit of a spongy feel to it. A rear sling mount right there. The checkering on the grip of the stock is very well done. We see that same checkering on the forend there. Very nice with a sling stud up on the forend. I mentioned it has Glock mags, or it is suitable for Glock mags. All you have to do is punch out these three roll pins and take out the old mag, the Henry mag, and put in a Glock mag. It does have the magazine release right there, and I currently have a Glock 19 mag in there. The charger is ambidextrous. It's right there. Charge the rifle. All you have to do is pull it out and move it to the other side if you want to charge it from the left side of the rifle. The Ghost ring sight, the rear ghost ring sight is right there. It is adjustable. No need to adjust it for me. Right out of the case, it worked fine. And then the front is a blade. One of the things that is super cool about this is this lever here, it is also ambidextrous. We see it on both sides. All you have to do is pull the bolt back, push that upward, and that holds the bolt back. You could run a bore sling through it to clean it. The Barrel is threaded. There's a thread cap there. You can run a can on there if you wish. And there's a closer look at the front sight. Very nice package. And I like the adaptability of putting the Glock mags or P320, M&P 9, or just use the Henry mags right out of the case. Take a look at the top strap of the rifle. The American Walnut, I think, makes the rifle heavier but it is just beautiful, the craftsmanship of this. Check out the safety, thumb safety on the tang of the rifle, but the craftsmanship is second to none. Really nice setup, really happy with it. You know, I, I've taken quite a few shots. Now what I've noticed is that the, the sights, you put that ghost ring, you put that blade right in the middle of the ghost ring and you're pretty dead nuts each time I shot it. It is drilled and tapped to put a rail on there in case you want to, there's a motorcycle riding by here, kind of in the trails. But you can put a rail on there, put an optic. I don't know, I kind of kind of want to keep it the way it is. You know, it's a, it's a Henry, which in my estimation is fine out of the case. But there's a closer look at it. Beautiful rifle, very accurate. No pushback at all with the 9mm.
Henry Homesteader. I told you the MSRP is in the mid to upper 900s. However, I did a quick search and you can find this anywhere between 800 to the MSRP prices. But if you get a chance, check it out. It's a beautiful rifle. Very easy, smooth shooting rifle made by Henry. The craftsmanship is amazing. The accuracy is really nice. And I like having a rifle within an op without an optic for once because it takes me back to that old time shooting. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.